Hey guys, Jennifer Sparks. I'm back in Orlando and I'm super, super excited. I'm going to one of my favorite places in every, <laughs> in all the land, the Grand Floridian Hotel, Resort and Spa. Most of you watching probably know about as much as or more than I know about this resort. I've stayed here once. I'm not staying here. This is not about the rooms. This is going to be a walkthrough of the resort. We're also going to be eating at the Grand Floridian Cafe and we're going to be checking out Enchanted Rose, which is the Beauty and Beast's new bar there. We had drinks and I got there early and was able to take really nice videos of the place. So if you're interested in that, please stick around and enjoy the tour with me. If you enjoy these kind of videos, these resort tours and reviews, please subscribe to my channel. That would rock. So here we are. We're in the grand entrance. This place is amazing. It's got that stunning bam wow factor. As soon as you walk in there, it's gorgeous. If you get the chance and you're ever here in December or even November, you got to check it out for Christmas. It is stunning. Have you ever been to this amazing place before? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. I've been coming to Disney World since they opened when I was a child. And I used to bring my kids here when I had children here every year. We even one year bought an annual pass and we came three times in one year. We're from Connecticut, so it was quite, you know, quite an adventure. But they loved it so much, they both ended up going into the Disney College program. Um, we'll discuss more of that later because right now we are at the Grand Floridian Cafe. They have that um, scan thing where you scan your phone. It's a contactless menu, so I took some screenshots of, you know, it's like a brunch type of menu for breakfast and lunch all day. Like you could get a hamburger at eight o'clock in the morning or you could get like an omelet at three o'clock in the afternoon. This is that reliable place <laughs> that you could always depend on being open, except between three and five, I believe they close. I had had a hamburger, which was pretty good. And my daughter Star had the French toast, which she liked a lot too. That's my daughter Star. If you do want to dine here, make sure you get the Disney My Experience app and get a reservation. It wasn't busy right now, but it does get full. Now we're going to the Enchanted Rose. This is the new Beauty and the Beast themed bar. It's awesome. We were so lucky to get there early and we were able to get in, walk around before all the other people arrived. There are all kinds of different drinks on the menu. Um, and there's all different kind of places you could sit. You could sit at the bar. They have little tables by the window. They have outside. Uh, it, it's just a really, really pretty place. So, you know, the drinks are pricey, but it's a cover charge for getting into this magical place. I'm going to be quiet now and let you enjoy the little tour. If you want to stick around, we're going to be going to Basin and a couple of the gift shops. And we're going to go take a walk through the lobby. And then we're going to go take a walk outside. And I'm going to be walking over to the Poly. And I'm going to be having another video of that later on in this week. Hopefully, maybe tomorrow. <laughs> well, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Enjoy the tour.
My daughter Star and I both had espresso martinis. She just turned 21, so this was kind of fun to go out with her. They were delicious and they were, you know, had a, a little kick to them. They were pretty good. visiting a store called Basin. They have one also in Disney Springs as well. It's uh, all kinds of soaps and bath bombs and salts and all kinds of, all kinds of good smelling things. <laughs> Now through a little stroll through their very large gift shop, which has mostly obviously the Disney merch. I mean, anything in the world that you could possibly want, you could find it here. Like to add this place has the most gorgeous rugs <laughs> and dramatic staircases of any hotel I've ever stayed at. I mean, they're just beautiful. I could totally picture like a wedding pictures here. I'm sure a lot of people came here for the wedding pictures. It's just, just gorgeous. You feel like a princess when you're there or a prince. I was lucky the day I was here it was pretty empty um I do have two videos I made a couple years ago when I was staying here that I'm gonna link at the end one was dawn like when the sun was rising I went outside and I took videos and also I came in here at like five in the morning when nobody was around and I took some videos with nobody in them but this one <laughs> not that many people are in this one either <laughs> But if you want to see those, I'm going to link those in the uh, playlist at the end of the video if you want to click on those and watch those as well. I do have to say these green couches right here are probably the most comfortable couches I've ever sat in. <laughs> I absolutely love them. I could just sit there all afternoon and listen to the music and the pianist sometimes plays. This place is just gorgeous. Everything's really white and bright, even though it's like a 1920s theme. Nothing's dark, nothing feels dated. Everything's just very grand and beautiful. And you know, it's Disney, everybody's really nice and it's just great. I mean, if you ever get the opportunity to stay here, I'd say definitely do it. And if you can, it's it's very expensive to stay here, but you know, you could always book like I do. I, I book a, a lunch or a brunch or something like that. You know, and you get to walk around and like you just enjoy the atmosphere. This over here is the spa, which is a big deal over there. They, I guess they do a lot of services. And look at, there's the monorail go by. <laughs> and that's the Polynesian. It's a short walk over there. The Polynesian, temporarily, the monorail stop is not working. They're doing construction over there. If you like this video or found any of it helpful, please subscribe and check out my um, video I made of the California Grill Wave Breakfast at the Contemporary Resort. I just made that and I'll be working on the Polynesian video this week. Thank you for watching. Safe travels to you.